What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Tasha, a.k.a. Mama Jim, a.k.a. Jim the Butterfly. I'm here with your Libra, September 2018. Love. Sarah I'm about to drop my cards. Um, thank you guys so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing to my videos. Be sure to hit the little bell down there so you can be one of the first people to be notified when I drop a new video. All right, guys, let's see what you got coming in real quick. General energy for love and relationships. You know, we're going to pick a card for your challenge. We'll also pick a card. Well, that's going to be your challenge. Um, we'll also pick a card for your advice and your your outcome and this is right on the top and there's two cards stuff okay we need a general okay your general energy so your outcome already we already know is a seven so as i feel like you're moving away from something okay we're starting we're kind of starting backwards but here we go you're moving away from something that th i feel like there's going to be some investigative work it's kind of like this month is going to end off on a to be continued type of mode but let me see what your general energy is your general energy is <laughs> the magician the challenge is the a of wands your advice is the tower reverse and then boom. Okay, so look, let me tell you what's going on this month. All right, with the magician, you have some information, baby. Okay, there's something that you are, I feel like either you have the information or you trying the information, like you you got the power. Remember that song? I got the power. Like you have the power this month. It's all about whatever you need to know, whatever you need to obtain, whatever you need to retrieve, whatever you need to say, whatever. You have it all right here. Whatever you need to put your energy into, you have it. Okay? Wonderful, wonderful card this month because you are the magician. This is all about intention. It's about manifestation. It's about, this is about your solar plexus being in a very strong place. You have the willpower. You have the determination to get what you want in the matters of love. So I feel like for some of you, you have your eye on somebody. Okay? Um, I, I, feel, I feel like that. It's like somebody's on your radar. All right? But see, the challenge is, it's like with the magician here with this number one i feel like this is this is the initiated card for some of you want to, you want to initiate a conversation with a particular person okay again somebody's on your mind um and they on your radar but with the challenge here with the eight of wands in uh it's not even ring in reverse i'm sorry the challenge here in uh, here is the eight of wands. I'm feeling like whatever you feel like you need to say, or you want to say, you might need to hold off on that. Okay. Um, I also feel like for some of you, if this is a long distance relationship, maybe this person lives farther away from you. You know, maybe this person lives across the country. Maybe this person is, um, on the other side of the planet. Um, it, that's the challenge right now. You know, distance, Words being said, maybe at at the same time. Let me see what else I what I pick up here. Yeah, I'm feeling like words un, unspoken. Also, I feel like for some of you too, whereas you may be very outgoing and extroverted in how you communicate, this particular person makes you kind of cower down because remember, this is coming in in your challenge position so whereas you would be a little bit more forthcoming right now you're not you kind of meek like a lamb here you see it so um you something maybe the words don't come to you the way that you would like to you know maybe you're stuttering all over yourself like i do sometimes <laughs> but that's your challenge your advice this month with the tower here in reverse um, I feel like what it's saying is to take it a little slow, a little slower than what you actually want to do, because here you are, right? Like, yo, I am ready. I'm going to say this. I'm going to do that. You know, and this can go for a male or a female. It really doesn't matter, um, who is the suitor and who is the person doing the pursuing, but I, I feel like whatever, you're going to have to take it slow. I feel like what you're going to have to do with this advice card is saying to drop little nuggets. You can't lay it all on them at one time, sugar. They they can't deal with all that heavy ass energy at one time. You got to lay it on them 
really, really slowly. Let me get to, I want to get a, a clarification card because what you're doing, you're ending up the end of the month with the seven of swords. I kind of feel like what this is also telling you too, is to do your research about this person. You have a, I feel like you have a crush for real, for real, but you have to do your research about this person. All right. And be willing to believe whatever you hear. I don't necessarily feel like you're going to hear anything negative, but I do feel like you, it's like, take what you can and leave the rest with this seven of swords. Okay. Some of y'all straight up, I ain't gonna lie. Y'all get your Spokio on. You're going on Spokio.com. You're going on whitepages.com. You're looking up Facebook pages. You're doing all type of crazy shit, but it ain't really crazy. You just being investigative. I get it. Okay. And so that's what I said. This month is ending off on kind of like a to be continued because, but it's like this magician card is giving you the energy you need to keep the stand, keep your momentum going because somebody like, again, again, I say somebody's on your radar and you can have everything that you need to find out what you need to. You may, this may be even word of mouth. You may not even have to resort to electronic means to get your information. You just may have, maybe, you know, some people that they know. Okay. Let me get a, um, I do want to get a, a clarification card for the seven of swords just to, okay. <laughs> what is that for the seven of swords? Yeah, I have the four of pentacles in reverse, the eight of pentacles and the hangman in reverse. Yeah, I, again, it goes back to what I said, especially with this four of pentacles here in reverse. Whatever information that you gathered, now is not the time to let this person know, yeah, I've been checking for you. Okay? And you also want to make sure that you're moving in stealth mode when you're doing your research. Okay? Be careful about who you ask. Be meticulous in your approach with this situation. Okay? Um, and I'm also feeling like, too, like, you got to let things be willing to let things kind of happen organically at this time. But you know what? I, I'm, I would love to see what's going to happen for you guys in November because this is starting you off for a great September month when it comes to love because you have everything you need, honey, to find out what you need to about this particular person. Or, and I'll just say this too, this could be um, maybe someone has uh, their eye on you. Libra, and maybe someone is doing this to you. Now, you know, things may change and you find that somebody else is doing this to you, but I have to put that out there because I feel like for some of you, you may be the eye, the apple of someone's eye right now, and you don't even know it. You have everything that they want. Okay. But, you know, again, let this situation, even though you, it looks good right now, and I'm not saying that is even bad, but I just feel very strongly that whatever you're feeling right now, Give it some time before you completely act on it for the month. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I love you. See you next month. Bye.